I don't think that there's going to be a lot in the future of uh, this city that will compare with this project. We saw a significant gap in the market for a world-class office and lifestyle destination. We wanted to design a building from the inside out with functionality, efficiency and sustainability in mind. We aspired to build one of the best office buildings in the world. We were brought on very early on the piece by ICD Brookfield to work with them to come up with the feasibility options for the development. We spent a lot of time in the due diligence phase with BSBG and, and, and the leadership of BSBG really empowered their team to, to give that extra bit of work to us to make sure we could get the project off the ground. Foster and Partners were the design architect that were awarded uh, the project. So we worked with Fosters um, both here and in London to develop the design. It's a collective uh, approach so that as they were designing, we were coordinating and preparing the, the models and drawings uh, hand in hand. So any decision they were making, it was on the spot with us included. Uh, so we could all make the, the right decisions for the project. And having Fosters there, you could see what their aspirations are and then we can ensure that um, those key elements are then protected. They do really want to achieve a very, very high level of, of design and they don't let up. You know, all the way through the design process, they're testing it, they're trying to improve it, they're trying to get the best they can for the client. And that does challenge an executive architect or interior designer. But we welcome that challenge uh, and I think we more than met it. Foster and Partners are a world leading uh, design practice and I think what they bring to a project is a design that really just speaks of understated elegance. You know, there's, there's no gimmicks, there's just good, clean, functional design. One of the big challenges here uh, in the DIC is a lot of the parking is contained in the podium and that obviously interrupts the arrival experience and the user experience as you interact on the lower levels with the, the building. Brookfield said, right, let's just take all the podium parking and push that into the basement, uh, which ended up in seven levels, 2,700 cars. At the time of construction, it was the world's largest basement. And that costs a lot of money to do that. But what that did was really sort of open up the building and the project to the DIFC and interacting with the, the streets outside uh, and allowed them to put 15,000 square metres of retail in the, in the podium um, and introduce people like the, the Arts Club. So it was an incredibly uh, clever play but it took a, a lot of commitment to, to get that done. BSBG took over the basement early on as Fosters wanted to focus their design uh, for the front of house and tower and podium parts of the building. Uh, and that also helped BSBG then push ahead with the authority approvals. That was hugely um, challenging uh, technically. We had to retain a lot of the structures that were already in the ground from a previous scheme. So ensuring that uh, everybody was happy to do that and the authorities were comfortable, that was a real challenge, getting that, that basement underway because that was obviously on the critical path of the project. So that was a, a big one. From the health and safety perspective, we have worked closely with the main contractor for management of all the HSE aspects. And at the end, we have achieved more than 21 million man hours without uh, last time incident, which is a great achievement given the complexity and the logistical issues and having more than 3,000 workers on site every day. There's a tremendous achievement for the team to achieve LEED Platinum, which makes it the largest LEED Platinum building in the, in the region. We kept pushing sort of beyond where the initial sort of benchmark was for the project. And it's great, you know, to, to have a project that you've worked on all the way through from the early design stages and seeing it all the way through to, to, to be built. I mean, that's 
for all of us in our profession. That's that's why we got into this. BSPG have uh, performed the role of an executive architect or an executive interior designer on numerous projects. Uh, I think for me, this is probably one of the best examples. Uh, right from day one, uh, Fosters and BSBG were really two companies, one team. BSBG were appointed on the project as the executive architect and they were integral to the uh, management of the consultant and contractor teams as well as being our key interface with local authorities and having strong qualities of teamwork and innovation really helped them uh, undertake the services in the way that they did. I'd heard very good things of BSBG and, and, and their team and the talent pool and the way they were very collaborative with the people they worked for. They went the extra mile, um, they, they gave a lot of time early days at risk to, to help us to get the project off the ground uh, and we'll forever be indebted to them for that and, and look their skills, their capability and, and the quality of their design has been first class. It's so exciting to see it getting better and better as it's starting to live. People are moving in and tenancies are starting to be occupied and people are starting to migrate through the public areas. It's now sort of a comfortable, extremely comfortable place within the urban fabric. And uh, it's just, for me, it's magnificent. I love the building and I've loved the process and the ability to be able to work on it. I think it's probably, probably the best project I'm ever gonna get to work on. BSPG is demonstrating uh, we can deliver such a large scale projects. I feel the ICD Brookfield project is one of the big milestone in my career and I won't simply forget the journey we had from the beginning up to the end. Brookfield uh, really coming into Dubai. They bring a you know, developed market, uh, tried and tested uh, level of experience. And to be able to work with such a sophisticated developer uh, in this market um, and produce the quality of product that they have, um, it's been a, a great experience for all of the people at BSBG that were able to enjoy that process. We always held very high aspirations for this project. We had a wonderful design team in Foster and & Partners and BSPG. We had the power horses of the Investment Corporation of Dubai, Brookfield Properties behind us. And we leveraged those strengths to develop a building which we think is one of the world's best. So we're incredibly proud of, of where we've gotten to and, and naturally seeing people's reactions when they walk into the building and, and also their enjoyment of the space is very satisfying. To describe the project in three words, I'd say elegance, dynamic and sustainable. High-end office building. Slick, innovative, high performance. Challenging, rewarding and spectacular. Best in class. A game changer. <laughs>